Hello, this is Dr. Alali. Uh, I'm trying to show you here how the different pipeline embolization device works to treat a large, very wide neck aneurysm that otherwise it would be very difficult to treat. What you're seeing now is just the standard technique how we put a uh, large, strong catheter closer to the aneurysm. That will allow us eventually to place the different flow diverters while we're treating these very difficult aneurysms, large with very wide neck. As you see now, the catheter is going up into the abdominal aorta. We get from the leg and then we go to the abdominal aorta all the way up to the neck and we place a very strong guiding catheter that will allow us to uh, place this uh, flow di different flow diverters. Now we're coming closer to the uh, aneurysm and the distal cervical carotid artery, all of that under direct fluoroscopic guidance, so uh, the physician always see where they are. So now we are we seeing, uh, coming closer to the end, that's the large aneurysm, the, cat, the flow here you see in the eye. Now we put a small catheter across the aneurysm, and then we pull it back, and then we unsheath the stent, and the stent now going to slowly open up. When it's open up, it will close the neck of this aneurysm, and since the mesh of the stent are very tight, it will not allow the blood to go through it. And now that you see with the injection of dye, the contrast has less uh, space to go inside the aneurysm. Uh, this is here is to, to show that the stent can reposition if the physician doesn't like the location. And however, now uh, this is which is very added value to the stent. So to, to allow us to be very precise, now the physician like the location and they can entry the stent and leave it there. Now we're just going up with the catheter to take the wire back and now we take everything out. At this time the flow, the blood will decrease its speed inside the aneurysm and will allow its clotting with time. Usually it takes few months, three to four months for this aneurysm to be totally occluded and uh, when it's completely clotted, it will shrink and slowly, slowly, slowly decrease its size. Maybe completely, maybe not. However, more important, the blood will not go there anymore. I hope that this video was very helpful for you. And if you have any questions, uh, please let me know. Thank you.